Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Today in this video, we are going to discuss about the process for applying to the University of Darmstadt. Basically, the Darmstadt University of Applied Sciences, which is in uh, Germany. Uh, the course is Electrical Engineering and Information Technology. It is an International Master of Science course. So let us start the process. Let's see how the process is. It's a simple process and uh, anyone can follow it. So the teaching language for the course will be in English and uh, the application deadline is 31st March for the winter semester. So it's already February and you can apply for the course. Also, you have to take care of this fact that uh, as the course is in English, but you have to do the German classes. So before entering into the course, uh, be sure that you are at least done with A1 so that by the end of the course, as the requirements is mentioned that you have to complete your A2. But it's okay while going to Germany, you can also go with A1 as well. So there are almost four to five major subjects you can choose from. It's automation major, communication majors, then embedded and microelectronics, and then power engineering majors. So I am going with the embedded uh, majors. Okay, let's go to the costs. So as we know, it's German university, no cost as such for tuition fees. Yes, there is a semester contribution of 280 euros. That's it. Language ILTS you require 6.5 or better. TOEFL you require 88 or better in the internet based exam and that's it uh, yes your previous requirement for academic is either b engineering or bsc in electrical engineering so let's go to the website the course website so this is the university website for that course uh, sorry the university website and um, everything over here is mentioned it's easy you can uh, click on any of the majors and check the curriculum for the same um, that's it. You, I'm choosing embedded. You can choose anything of your choice. So let's go to the admission site over there. International students. This is the page where you will get to know about the start of the program, all the dates and everything required for the application. Uh, yes, the application is through the Coppola. That's the application medium for this university. Uh, there's a link over there you can click on to that link and uh, land up on the application page so let's go so actually i have already applied for this course so first i'll log out from the portal okay now as you are applying for the first time you will see this page so just let's register for the portal it's simple you have to write your email id first name last name and create a password which then you will get a confirmation on your email id and you will <coughs> confirm it the process is quite simple uh, let's go to the login page i suppose all of you can do the registration part easily login you have to log in with your email id and your created password uh, just login into it okay so this is the portal fine so in the personal data first of all let's go to the personal data here you have to mention a name, your surname, your passport number and all those things. So I have already filled the details. You can check this. It's a simple step and uh, in the bachelor's degree, the degree will be international degree for the ones who are applying outside Germany. Uh, you have to write your address. Then you don't have to write anything in the request change of email address. Let it be blank. Just save the personal info and you will go outside okay over here in the apply for study place you will get a drop down basically for the majors so let's see the majors so you have basically four or five options for the major so automation communication majors embedded major and power engineering i have chosen embedded electronics and micro electronics as a major so you'll get that drop down i've already selected it so i cannot change it now but that uh, step is simple Let's go to the academic background. You have to write your bachelor's information over there, your engineering, bachelor's in engineering information. So the beginning date of your bachelor's, my case it was 2017, end date will be 2021. Degree as its bachelor's, 
a few of them who, uh, who are doing the double major double masters you can select me uh, masters and bachelor mm-hmm. both the degrees one by one actually mm-hmm. so results i have already finished the exam university name then yes that's it the subject is uh, my bachelor's stream that is electronics and telecommunication engineering then country will be india and grade that's 8.71 in my case uh, for my university the maximum possible grade was 10 the minimum was 4 and uh, even the worst will be 4 this bas- uh, basically actually you can even write 0 because it depends um, important thing is maximum and minimum worst it depends like you can write 4 or 0 both will work out don't worry about that and that's it now you have to upload the documents so this is a list of the documents you have to upload cv passport lor degree certificate who haven't got the degree certificate you can apply your passing certificate or provisional degree certificate then your ilts or tofel school certificates uh, motivation letter transcripts and there's one thing at the end declaration of authority i'll tell you about that so i have uploaded the documents here it is Uh, I'll tell you about the declaration of authority thing. So go to the upload button. You'll get a template to fill the uh, affidavit form. Uh, it's simple. Uh, you have to write your name, then registration number, and date and signature at the end. So you can uh, use the Adobe signature uh, feature from Adobe. and uh, you can edit this form and paste it as it is or you can print out and then uh, write it down sign it and then upload it okay so for the registration number choose this application number as a registration number and write it over here date and signature print it or save it if you are doing it soft copy and upload it and that's it this is the entire process for applying and you have just be sure before Uh, clicking on the uh, start assessment you have to be sure that all the information is correct because after submitting it you don't have any chance to correct any of the information unless and until the university uh, allows you to do so uh, but don't rely on that just be sure that you have uploaded everything correctly and uh, everything is fine and then click on to the start assessment that's it they will communicate you uh, if you get an admit or if you if they need any other document as such you'll get the messages in the messages tab so that's it guys thank you i hope this process will help each and everyone who is applying for the universities and damsted being a very decent university you can obviously try for it just give it a shot the tuition fees over there are absolutely zero you just have to pay for your living expenses the eating expenses and a nominal tuition a nominal uh, college fee of around 200 to 300 euros per semester so that's not a big issue i suppose and that's it for the video i'll upload more of such videos related to university other universities from germany also i'll be uploading processes for the university of, of canada and usa so just be tuned on this channel and uh, bye bye thank you do like share and subscribe and hit the bell notification so that you will get a notification on time so thank you guys thanks a lot bye bye